everybody, hello boys and girls. Now today we're going to read a new storybook together. In this storybook we're going to see why bees are so important for the earth, right? So we already learned that we can plant our own seeds to plant, to make new flowers, new vegetables, new fruits. But the bees, they also help us make new flowers, new fruits, new vegetables by pollinating different flowers. Now let's see in this book, right? So wow, look at this beautiful book cover. It's so colorful. And the book is called Nature's Tiny Miracle Bee. Can you see the bee in there? Right in the middle of the flower. Wow, and the book is by Britta Tecantro. Now let's say thank you, Britta, everyone. Thank you, Britta. Now, would you like to see what's inside? Everyone say, open please. Ready? Open please. Let's have a look together. Wow, can you see the bee? Dawn is breaking on a brand new day. And in the meadows, poppies sway. Can you see all the beautiful poppies? A bee appears over there, striped black and gold. A wonder of nature is about to unfold. In the treetops, birds start to sing over there. The little bee beats her wings. Can you beat your wings just like this? Pretend to be a bee buzzing around. As the she travels here and there, a gentle thrumming fills the air. Back and forth, toing and froing. The bee knows exactly where she is going. Where do you think the bee is going? Visiting flowers of every hue. She has a special job to do. Now let's see what's the special and very important job of the bee. Gathering nectar as she goes. From every foxglove, every rose, dusty with pollen, the little bee buzzes, buzzes busily. So now can you see the bee picks up the pollen, it's the yellow line that we see here, she picks up the pollen, zzz, buzzes to the next bee, to the next flower, and puts the pollen into the next flower. And again she goes, zzz, and puts the pollen into the next flower. And that's called pollination. And that's how bees, the pollinators, help flowers grow. Wow, what a miracle. Bee travels on from bloom to bloom drawn in by their sweet perfume. Flowers smell so nicely, right? Harvesting flowers one by one, a compass is the midday sun. Can you see the sun is shining and it's a beautiful warm spring day. Among the orchards, apple trees blossom quivers in the breeze. Can you see? Now you can see all the different trees. They have some blossoms as well. That means they have little flowers in spring, like for example the peach tree or the apple tree. Now the bee is helping with the pollination for the apples to grow. If not, without the bees, we wouldn't even have certain fruits and vegetables. So let's say thank you bee. Thank you bee. Carrying pollen from place to place, bee always leaves a tiny trace. Can you see the tiny trace of pollen? Flowers as far as the eyes can see. Wow, so many flowers. Too many flowers for just one bee. Do you think one bee can do it all by herself? No, right? All of a sudden, bee is gone. She has a message to pass on. Now where is she going? Back at the hive, can you see the beehive? Their home, the bees home. Back at the hive, bees spreads the news. There's work to be done, no time to lose. Listen for the gentle humming, 
the word is out that bees are coming. So she's going to get all of her friends and family and she says, let's go, we have work to do. Buzzing over the dense hedge rows, past the pond where white fine grows. Through the orchard's sweet smelling scent, the bees travel on with calm intent. And you see so many bees together now. As lilies glow orange in the sun, the bees must finish what they've begun. Quick, 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 they need to finish their pollination. Stopping at every flower they find, leaving the gift of pollen behind. And all of them leaving some pollen in all the different flowers. The bees pass over a wooden stream, droplets sparkle and pebbles gleam. Water trickles, bubbles and weep, waves. A weeping willow trails its leaves. Wow, look at how many bees are helping now. Let's see if they can do it before the sun goes down. As the bees fly on through buds and birds, a tiny miracle occurs. For every plant and flower you see was given life by one small bee. Wow, look how many beautiful, beautiful flowers. And the bees helped make the flowers grow, had to make new flowers grow. Wow, what a beautiful story. I hope you enjoyed the story just as much as I did. Goodbye everyone.